Hi, it's Dr. Kevin, and welcome to the hypothyroiddiet.com. Today I want to talk about TSH levels. If you have hypothyroidism, or you're trying to figure out if you do have it, and you're probably wondering about this number and where your number should be, but I'm here to tell you that TSH levels don't paint an entire picture for you, and it can be very misleading. Uh, all it's basically doing is telling you through a blood test that your body needs to produce more thyroid hormone, but it's not telling you exactly what's wrong with your body, and there can be a number of different causes of hypothyroidism. So in order to really determine what's going on with your condition, you need to have an entire thyroid panel done, not just the TSH levels. I know a lot of physicians just order the one marker, but I'm telling you, in order to really determine what's going on with you and to get to the bottom line, why you have hypothyroidism, you need an entire thyroid panel done. So just don't rely on TSH levels. Make sure you get the entire panel done, including uh, what we call thyroid antibodies. Those are very, very important. So anyway, it's Dr. Kevin. Uh, I'm at the hypothyroiddiet.com. Hopefully this was helpful for you. Until next time, eat well and be well.